said, we're marching in and we're going to release those cattle you stole. That's what it's all about. You see that movie Free Range with Kevin Costner and Robert Duvall that's based on a composite of true stories? That's what this is, but the people back down. The establishment back down. They're going to regroup. They're going to try this stuff, but here's the deal. Americans haven't been slaves because we're cowards. We've been slaves because we've been in a trance, asleep. But let me tell you something. That spell's breaking. And nothing on earth is going to stop it. This is so exciting. And it's a great testament to the new media that has supplanted the enemy media. And it's, there's going to be great trials and tribulations. But in the final equation, by the grace of God, we're going to beat these people. We're going to talk to folks that were there coming up. Were you there? Or are you watching it live? We'll take your calls as well. 877-789-ALEX. Wide open phones. 877-789-2539. Stay with us. Geopolitical news coming up after calls. Globalist social engineers are not just targeting us with propaganda. They are manipulating our genetics. We are being targeted at every level by estrogen mimickers that lower our testosterone and other hormones and natural compounds that the body needs. After consulting top doctors, nutritionists, pharmacists, and others, we have developed what I believe is the ultimate non-GMO organic super male vitality formula sourced from powerful organic herbs and then concentrated for maximum potency potency super male vitality was developed to activate your body's own natural processes instead of using synthetic chemicals super male vitality by infowars life is so powerful that i only take half the recommended dose for a limited time we are offering 15 percent off super male vitality at infowarslife.com to introduce you to this powerful supplement visit infowarslife.com today to secure your super male vitality infowarslife.com why does the United States spend the largest percentage of GDP in the world on health care? Why do we have the highest cancer rates on the planet, the highest rates of diabetes, autism, and every other major disease? It all comes down to one thing. We are what we eat. Our food is devoid of nutrition and processed with poisons and additives. Our water is filled with toxic poisons and big pharma runoff. All of this has been engineered by design. We can turn the tide against the eugenicist by giving ourselves the nutrients our body desperately needs. To learn more, visit InfoWarsHealth.com. The site is literally packed with audio and video featuring top health professionals who don't bow down to Big Pharma. The fight against the New World Order starts with you, and you can't stand against the machine of your sick, tired, and obese. When you visit InfoWarsHealth.com, be sure and check out the catalog with nearly 400 life-changing products, and get free shipping when you sign up for AutoShip. This is Alex Jones for InfoWarsLife.com. The latest in preparedness is now here. An electrically stabilized colloidal silver solution that can be added to both your home cabinet and preparedness pack alike. Concentrated to 30 parts per million in what has been dubbed the Survival Silver Solution. The new InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver is the answer for you and your family. And it's entirely free of toxic artificial additives that are loaded into many products. The InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Silver is so powerful that it is concentrated into a two ounce bottle and is not recommended for extended continual use. This is not a low grade formula. We are working with one of the top laboratory manufacturers in the United States to bring you the best form of colloidal silver using electrical processes within a base of deionized water for your preparedness storage or your home kitchen. Purchase your bottle of InfoWarsLife.com Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver today and find other amazing supplements at InfoWarsLife.com. A chemical spill contaminating the water supply in nine West Virginia counties. This year alone, over 300,000 people in West Virginia had their drinking water contaminated. What are the health effects of having these drugs in our drinking water? It's forced medical treatment without the consent of residents. My friends, water filtration is one of the most basic actions you can take to protect you and your family from the harmful toxins and heavy metals in your tap water. On average, the county says it sprays with the glyphosate at least once a week. Few filters cut out the glyphosate that is found in water supply 
supplies worldwide. Remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, hydrofluorosilicic acid, sodium hexafluorosilicate. Fluoride, it is in tea, it's in coffee, it's in water, it's in bread, it's in toothpaste. It is our responsibility to protect our families. The establishment's not going to do it. It's time to take action. It's time to filter our water. Visit InfoWarsStore.com and use promo code WATER to get 10% off their entire family of incredible products. Or call toll-free 888-253-3139. Coast to coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. We are on the march. The empire is on the run. Alex Jones and the GCN Radio Network. All right, we had a couple callers from Nevada who said they were there, but they hung up. I I'm going to calls right now. We but I want people's take on what they just witnessed happened out there. We'll do that for two segments, then I'll get into the huge developments in the Ukraine. I told you it's going towards civil war, the country being divided into two, partitioned. That's now moving towards that. Uh, more on the NSA being behind Heartbleed, as I told you, that's now coming out. We're going to be breaking it all down. But again, this is about showing the power of the people. And then when you stand up, you have the moral authority. When the government's in the wrong, you can push back. And when it came out that Harry Reid, I said Friday, I said they're going to back down now when they were saying they weren't. When Harry Reid's involved with the communist Chinese government, one, and they list in the documents that we found. It actually came out in the news two years ago, but no one was connecting it now. But Harry Reid, in these BLM documents, were saying we got to get rid of Bundy and his land. He won't sell. We've got to get that property for the solar farm. It actually says the solar farm. I mean, who could make that up? Harry Reid and the communist Chinese backed, you know, government backed company to go in there and run this. And you've got armed paramilitary police there treating farmers and ranchers like total crud. They've run 52 families out of the area who were there in the same group of Mormons that came in in the 1870s. They've run them all out except one guy, last man standing. And, you know, the last guy standing, because the people came to his aid, stopped the establishment. And, you see, they can't script it bad. They can't demonize him. They can't plant drugs on an old cowboy with no criminal record. They can't, they can't kill him. He doesn't care because a country boy can survive. You can't starve us out. You can't make us run because these old boys were raised on shotguns. We say grace and we say amen. And if he ain't into that, we don't give a damn. And I'll go further than that. We should find that clip from Patton where he says, I've heard a lot of talk about Americans are scared to fight. Why Americans love to fight. And the establishment better get that through their pea brain. All you twinkle toes, it turns out Jay Carney's house is full of communist propaganda. Well, yeah, I remember back it came out in, in the Associated Press in the mid-90s that the Clintons had crack pipes and stuff and linen stuff on the uh, Karl Marx, Vladimir Lenin stuff on the Christmas tree. These are weirdos that are into desecrating anything that isn't part of their weirdness. These are freaks, folks. Figure that out. We're not the ones looking for trouble. We're the producers in this country. We don't want to fight with you, but you try to extinct us. You call us better clangers. We love God and we love our guns. We love being independent. You want a war. You start it. You own it. Who says the new order has to take over? Who says we have to lose? Who says it's the end of the world? These government-run churches that are creating self-fulfilling prophecies of doom. They're frauds. God always gives a country and gives a culture a chance to repent and turn back. And if you don't believe in God, in cycles, many times civilizations turn back from the brink. I want to turn back. I want prosperity. I want to be honorable. I want to be free. I want justice. What's wrong with that? And I'm sick of being lied to and told I'm racist because I can read Obamacare and know it's a screw job. And now we're into the screw job a year. You like it? Said I'd go to your calls. Man, we got Mark and we got, we got like 15 calls here. Gary, Caleb, Dave, JT Code, Rashid, Don, Willis, Sheila, Om, um, Bob, Mousalink. Mark in Utah, you were there at the Nevada standoff. 
For folks that haven't seen the video on InfoWars.com, am I exaggerating how incredible this was? No, Alex, not at all. It was, uh, I'm 59 years old, and that was the most amazing day of my life. Uh, I'm originally from Oklahoma, and I tell you what, I've never been more proud of Cowboys in my life. It was absolutely amazing. I was at David Knight and Josh down there, Stuart Rhodes, uh, the courage of the women Cowboys. All, everybody, like, it put tears in my eyes a dozen times. And I'm a longtime listener, a first-time caller, but you said some. This is why I'm calling in. You said something the other day that uh, you said you can't be around those kind of people anymore because it tears you up to bad guys. And I tell you what, brother, you deserve to be there because it's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. Well, my, and my problem is I don't go out of fear to a lot of these things. I, I've been arrested quite a few times. I get really upset. And now I'm so upset about all this, I just can't be around it anymore. I mean, if I see some cop taser a woman in the back for no reason, I mean, I just can't, I just, I have to, I have to run this operation. But I wish I'd have been there. But look, it doesn't matter. Look at David Knight. Look at you. Look at Josh. Look at all the people there. We salute you. You are the future. You don't need Alex Jones. They could kill me tomorrow. They Look, it's like V for Vendetta. Ideas are bulletproof. And I'm telling you, we can beat these people. Absolutely. We did yesterday, brother. What was it like uh, to watch them with their armored vehicles and helicopters pulling out and running? Because they pointed guns and said, we're going to kill you, and the people didn't care. That that was so Mahatma Gandhi, but with the added guns at the side that once you pull the trigger, though, bud, get ready. No, it was it was hairy. And looking at the guys looking at us, I was watching with binoculars. Uh, and I was waving at the guy with the sniper scope on me, and I got to admit I wasn't using all my fingers when I was waving at him. Uh, and let me guess, it didn't scare you to have him aiming that gun at you? Because I protested the Klan one time, and they were aiming guns at me, the, the SWAT team in the parking garage, and I laughed at him. It's like when these cowards aim a gun at you and you've done nothing, it didn't scare you, did it? No, it didn't. And I was... I was so blown away at the bravery of the people and stuff like this is the best I felt about America in This years. is America. That's right. This is, That's listen, right. we were special. The whole world said it. The most patents, the best trailblazers, the best fighters, the most courage. America was special, and that's why the globalists came here and took us over. And they've turned us into this fraud, and it's time it stops now. The spirit can awesome. spread. The spirit can spread, my friend. I mean, I could feel it Friday. Friday, that's why I got so excited. I could feel it. I mean, listen, there's a lot of providence here, too. John Baum was here. They all saw it. They wouldn't believe it. 1130, I run around yelling. I go, Harry Reid's behind it. Look it up. They go, well, how do you know? And I go, I don't. Harry Reid's involved. I don't, that doesn't usually happen like that, but it happens sometimes. And, guys, he went and looked. It was Harry Reid, wasn't it? Absolutely. Uh, I mean, it, it's just, did you see me run around screaming Harry Reid? There's an energy in this building that is filled with providence. Absolutely. I mean, folks, it's real. George Washington talked about it. It's real. What, you just think the devil gives tricks to his boys? I tell you what, Alex, the, the faith and the spirit, was it was flat out said nobody was beating around. These are God-fearing people, family, community, and the way those people pulled together, uh, I haven't had my heartstrings plucked like that. Honestly, I don't think ever, other than some family things, but... Doesn't well, you wait till like 300. That's a true story. You wait till they kill a bunch of patriots, folks, and it's on. But I don't want that to happen because the globalists have that as a backup plan. They don't want that, but it's one of their plans to have a civil war where we kill the cops, they kill us. We do not want that. We want to kill their lies and, 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 and free the minds of these paramilitary police. And I, I'll bet you a lot of money a lot of those paramilitary police did not like what they were part of there. God bless you. I salute you. Great job. Anything else, Mark? I'd like to say this about the militia. I talked to a number of people there, and I tell you what, buddy, everybody I talked to was the real deal. They were well-balanced. They were there. We salute the militia. Went. Second Amendment. God bless you. Great job. We salute them. They were key. We're going to come back with more of your calls. Stay with us. I'm Alex Jones, InfoWars.com.
The globalists have controlled the mainstream media for a long time, but now they're expanding and making the weaponization even more vicious and deceptive. All the major networks are state-run. We are partnering this year with the NFL. The NFL has become a political weapon against the Second Amendment and pushes Obamacare. MSNBC tells us that our children belong to the state. We have to break through our kind of private idea that kids belong to their parents or kids belong to their families and recognize that kids belong to whole communities. It is more important than ever to realize that we are not the alternative media. We are the true media. The establishment dinosaur press is dying. We are in an information war, and we are losing that war. Join us at InfoWarsNews.com and PrisonPlanet.tv. Members can share their memberships with up to 11 people. By subscribing, you will literally be buying war bonds in the InfoWar to expand our operation in the face of the tyrants. Join us at